testing testing one two three yeah my name is tori i have a soft voice but that's okay because yo man you still want to play and pay for my dates i don't know what rhymes with date i like grapes okay anyways um oh should i do my cover photo wait is that how the rappers do it okay anyway <laughs> fourth time wearing Dora she doesn't shed I mean she does but not like any other wig you know it's giving a girl scalp um actually this wig okay y'all don't care this has nothing to do with the video anyways as you can see from the title to tonight because it's like nine o'clock we're going to be doing a vision board and uh, vision board manifest board so yeah, y'all like my shirt? It's Art the Clown from the movie The Terrifier. That is like in my top three. I love that thing. It's so corny, but I love it. I have printed off a bunch of pictures because I have a lot that I want in life. And I'm in a position now where I'm young and I can take advantage of trying to reach these goals. So yeah. So we have quite a few, you know. Um, Oh, should I do my cover photo? Wait, is that how the rappers do it? Okay, anyway. Um, so, I probably should have grouped them in groups because I had, like, a bunch of pictures that kind of depict the same thing, but it was just, like, I don't know. Anyway, so we have, you know, this little polystyrene board. I think that's polystyrene. board same thing and I could have swore I had glue but I can't find it but I still have stuff in boxes that are like I still have stuff in totes and they just got the stator for a minute because I don't know where it's at actually let me get my microphone because my voice is super soft and y'all probably can't hear me right now so I'll be right back testing testing one two three yeah my name is tori i have a soft voice but that's okay because yo man you still want to play and pay for my dates i don't know what rhymes with date i like grapes okay anyways i did that anyways okay so you can finally hear me i'm sorry if my necklace hits the microphone and it okay anyways let's get into it so what i'm going to do is i have all my pictures on my bed i'm going to close my eyes and randomly pick one i'm going to explain it put it on the board manifest so it's probably going to be a long video by the way um okay okay oh <laughs> okay so here we have a castle um i don't know why but i just love castles like you're telling me people used to live in that all that space like it's beautiful and i always well not always but i'd be telling my family like oh if i was rich i'd buy us a castle so that all of us could live in it um because that'd be fun like they are my besties and sadly my well not sadly my only friends as of now and they mean the world to me and i love y'all to death like y'all really my homies like okay let's get into the next one i'm sorry if y'all can hear me swallowing too i'm chewing gum okay oh next we have an all black jeep wrangler hard top because i hate the soft tops like girl wait but yeah this is my dream car even if i was like a, a billion trillionaire i would still just get a jeep like they're so pretty and i was supposed to have one but that's all i'm gonna say but i didn't get one but that is my dream car i will be getting it within the next three-ish years i'm manifesting so there's my jeep and I already see, I put it off another Jeep photo, so I'm just going to put that up there too. I want two Jeep, 
two Jeeps, well three, I want an all white one, all black one, and a purple one, or a pink, purple or pink, one of those colors, so yeah, let me put that on there too, twins, okay, next picture, oh, it's crooked, sorry, I'm still trying to learn the whole setup thing, maybe if I do this, okay, okay, next we have, this is an in-home library, um, I really like reading books, I want a lot of books. Y'all should see my Books a Million half price, half price books and Barnes and Noble uh, wish list. It's a lot of books on there. So one, maybe one day in my castle, I'll have an in home library. And yeah. And then, oh, this is a, another one. I, oh, <laughs> and another one. And I think that was all. So yeah, in-home library. Okay, next to manifest. Oh, okay, so this is basically symbolizing me being a dog mom. Kids, ill. No, I do not want those freeloading. No, I'm just kidding. You know, I don't really like kids if I'm being quite frank. I, I'm not going to say I hate kids because there's some cool kids. But kids, stay away from me. Like, Besides my, my nieces, I have three nieces. Uh, Zuri, Kaya, and Corey. Why did I do it this way? Cause, well, who's the oldest? I think Zuri's the oldest. So Zuri, Kaya, Corey. And then I have two nephews, Devante and Hunter. I love them, you know. I am the, ooh. I consider myself the fun auntie, the slightly tipsy auntie, the always has a new man auntie, um, fur coat in the summertime just because I'm trying to show off auntie. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm living in that. In terms of kids, I prefer fur children, aka dogs. So I would be a dog mom. I love dogs. I've always loved dogs my whole life dogs you know dog mom bearded dragon mom too maybe even a ferret mom and koi fish mom that those are my children in the future but yeah so next manifestation okay this is a um, camera i want a camera it's like a sony viz it has a really long name i can't afford it right now but yeah i want one because i use my phone right now Nothing wrong with using the phone, but um, you know how iPhones be with storage and stuff like that. And like, <sighs> I just want an actual camera. I've wanted a camera for years, years, and I still haven't gotten one, but in due time, cause I'm manifesting. Okay, next one. Okay, so this is a kawaii. Um, gaming setup you can see that i'm shaking i'm sorry the three consoles and it's all girly and cutesy um mine probably wouldn't be all girly and cutesy mine would probably be how my room is now how it's like bluish anime-ish um even though i don't my favorite color is purple i don't like blue but blue just kind of makes everything fit together because there's like a lot of blue and like my anime posters my marvel posters like just it just made sense you know but it's still feminine you know so next manifestation um i honestly don't know what this is supposed to symbolize i think it's uh have oh it's having my own business i what my own business so I can leave my fur children something. No, I'm just kidding. But really, I don't want to work for people my whole life. Like, why would I work for someone, dedicate my whole life to someone, someone else's business when they don't even care about me because they'll easily replace you. Um, like, people work for companies for literally their whole life and they don't get any retirement money. 
or they could work there for literally their whole life and then get fired like plus I want to be my own boss why do I want to work for the man when I could work for myself you feel me yeah I'm gonna leave it at that because I have other pictures we got a lot to get through so let me hurry up okay next manifestation I want to be fashionable again I want best dressed in high school three years in a row or two years I can't remember pretty sure it, it was it was three um lately my fashion sense is slowly coming back but like in high school I was that bitch I ain't gonna lie to you um I don't I think college happened because when you're in college you just wake up two minutes before class in your pajamas and go to class like that like I don't know I think that's why I lost my fashion sense but don't get it twisty a bitch still be looking good in a t-shirt and jeans and converse okay anyways next manifestation oh it's a corvette corvette hop in a mud jet like that <laughs> okay anyways i want a corvette too um or just like a cute little sports car i don't know what exactly kind of sports car but i do want like a cute little sporty a little um fast car you know when i get tired of driving my three jeeps and i'm just feeling extra bougie in the castle i want to you know drive my corvette to starbucks or something you know something like you know anyways next manifestation oh we have a um pomeranian I miss I used to have a Pomeranian her name was Emma and she was cute and I, I don't know like I'm not really one of those like girls who want a Yorkie or like a cute little small dog but I actually like Pomeranian so manifesting that uh, okay then we have a balanced diet I'm tired of eating fast food all the time. Well, not all the time. Like, honestly, I've been pretty good the past couple weeks-ish uh, meal prepping. But I ain't gonna lie. A girl had a little depressive episode and I've been eating a lot of fast food lately. And I just wanted to be able to afford to eat nice and meal prep and <coughs> not eat processed foods. Like, I want to have my own garden eventually and just eat all organic fruits and vegetables clean balanced diet you know okay next we have a corgi they're so cute i've wanted a corgi for a while but they're so expensive and now that i have an apartment i'm kind of looking for dogs that don't make a lot of noise and they're pretty noisy and i don't want noise complaints so but in my castle, you know, I won't have any neighbors, so. Okay. Uh, here we have some uh, biking. Not necessarily mountain biking, but I do want to be one of those people that everybody hates who gets, who uh, cuts into traffic and then slows traffic down because people have to move around me because I want to be obnoxious and bike in the middle of the street. I want to do that because they be getting it and I just I don't know I just want to do that so yeah next we have another business owner thing notice how it's a woman it's crazy because when you google business owner they're all white men barely any women or black women at that but yeah I want to be a CEO and speaking of that I know I have a CEO picture yeah here it is CEO of what I don't know well actually I have a couple ideas but I'm not going to share it because last time I shared a business idea um, someone took it and now they do that for a living because they already had popularity and I didn't so I'm gonna keep that on the wraps but CEO okay next we have oh the rich auntie purr purr come on niecy what you want let's go to the louis vuitton store come on let's go that's gonna be me 
But, um, mom, I want to go to TT house. She got, like, 40 bedrooms, you know. That's going to be me. The rich auntie, bougie auntie, fashionable auntie. Yeah. Manifesting. Ooh. Oops, oops, oops. There we go. Okay, next we have another castle. And these are, like, <coughs> ooh. Y'all hear my voice crack? These are, like, in different countries because apparently america doesn't really have a lot of castles which i don't blame which i don't find surprising because america is ghetto but yep another castle okay next we have a garden i was just talking about how i want my own garden to grow my own vegetables because these corporations nowadays are literally poisoning y'all like i uh will sacrifice an extra buck to have all organic fruits and vegetables because in the long run gmos and stuff are detrimental to your health so and then we have ooh, we have another garden i should have cut out some tape beforehand but anyways um there's another garden oh wow another garden let me check to see oh yeah <laughs> another garden i'm pretty sure there's like one more yeah found another one i want a real life lemon tree i want trees like fruit trees growing up when i ooh, lived in the country of alabama i lived in a small country town called tuscumbia we had a walnut tree, an apple tree, a plum tree, a pear tree, a cherry tree, a cherry tree, um, honeysuckle. We had, we was, that was the life. I missed that. I want to be tatted up. <gasps> tatted up. <gasps> tatted up. Okay. Anyways, I want tattoos. Yes. Tattoo me, please a neck tattoo subtle like a cute little subtle tattoo nothing crazy you know back tatted legs tatted and manifesting so yeah i was going to get a tattoo one day because i had a little extra chunk of change but then my anxiety got the, ooh, my anxiety got the rest of me and i didn't go so okay next we have a friend i just want one friend one just one my go-to friend my best friend and you know i only want one friend i don't want a group of friends i don't want you know not even maybe okay it could be three of us total but i just want that one friend because women are messy drama ridden like ugh but yeah, I literally have no friends. I just have family, which, ooh, which nothing's wrong with that. But I do want someone my age that I can hang with, a girl, a female that I can hang with around my age, no kids, you know. Um, we can travel. I'm trying to shake my butt on a yacht in a thong and have a bestie that I can do stuff with, like, it's so like nobody tells you tells you when you get older it's literally impossible to make friends and i don't know why but it is so yeah my next one i want to go scuba diving i want to get my scuba license as well because i didn't realize how life-threatening scuba diving could be um yeah and my sister-in-law just sent me a video of this girl that went snorkeling and a baby crab got stuck in her ear and they had to like get tweezers to get it out but it ended up crawling out by itself and i'm like why would you send that to me because now i'm second guessing that but here we have a um what do you call it a van that's been what do you call it i forgot Re renovating a van and like traveling the world like doing a road trip that's awesome like y'all know that girl on youtube i think her name's janelle she does that for literally a living like <laughs> life ain't fair 
Okay, then I want to travel all 50 states. I've only been to Texas, Oklahoma, Kansas, Alabama, Virginia, Maryland, uh, Minnesota, Indiana, Tennessee. I think I've been to Mississippi, Florida, Georgia. Yeah, that's all I've been. I need to travel. Oh, here's another one, like an RV. Uh, yeah. Volkswagen vans are so pretty. Now that they're coming back, they're like super expensive. Okay, next we have another dog mom picture because I love dogs. Like, they love you unconditionally. You can leave them at home and they won't die. They just love you for being you. And I just want a dog because I don't plan on getting... <laughs> Well, I don't see me getting married because how men are nowadays, but who needs love when you have dogs? Next, we have the YouTube plaques. Uh, I think it's like when you have 10,000, it's either 10,000 or 100,000 subscribers, and then a million, and then 10 million. So, that is in my goals. I really want to be a YouTuber. I've wanted to for like over a decade. I'm 22 now, but I never really, I don't, it's a long story, but um, that is my dream. And nobody understands how hard it is to get subscribers when you're not popular, you don't have clout, you've never been popular. Um, like algorithms, man, it's hard. But anyway, I will, you hear me? I will get a YouTube plaque. Anyways, next manifestation we have, oh, hiking. I've never been hiking and I wanna go hiking. Um, like I said, I don't have friends or people to go with for real, so. And I want to have a dog. Well, when I have dogs, we're going to go hiking all the time. So there's that. Okay. Next, we have another friendship thing because I don't have friends. <sighs> like, I used, I used that Bumble BFF app. Never made a friend off there. And I was on there for, like, a good two years collectively and it's like a conversation will be going well and then they just ghost me and I'm like dang I just want a friend but it's whatever okay next we have this is supposed to symbolize traveling because I don't travel at all I really 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 I really really want to go to Greece because their water is literally like blue like a ice cold blue looking color and it's just so pretty. I wanna go to the Maldives. I wanna go to Hawaii. We're going to tropical places here because I hate being cold. But yeah, this is for traveling. Next we have uh, like self-care, self-love type thing. I really wanna start, or I really wanna be able to afford to go to spas all the time, get facials and massages and um, all that jazz because I can't afford it. <laughs> Next, we have another black girl luxury purr. Purr. I want to be luxurious. And honestly, I just want the, like, the freedom of it. Not necessarily the uh, materialistic version of it. Like, of course, I'm going to have me a Birkin or whatever. But I'm not going to be, like, overly you know Fendi all that like that's like I will have a giant collection of anime t-shirts and stuff like that that would be me but fashionable about it you know okay next we have another like healthy eating balanced diet type of thing because fast food is for the birds no they really need to make like a a vegan or a vegetarian all organic fast food chain restaurant i feel like it'll be expensive but still it's worth it next i really want to be um in shape active good health you know flexible 
just good health, basically. So, here's that. Next, I want to travel, like I said, to catch flights, not feelings. Um, yeah. Oop. Smudge this in here. Okay, next we have a math book, which I want one so bad because it'll make my life easier. And I feel like I will uh, fit in at Starbucks, but <laughs> I really want a math book. Next we have a cute little house. I do want a house, apartments, they're cool-ish. They're kind of convenient when you're younger, but I don't always want to live in an apartment because I don't want neighbors, like right, right next door neighbors. I want to be able to blast my music and stuff and not bother nobody. Next, we have a, a, a chi, what is it called? Palm chi, which is a Pomeranian and a Chihuahua mix. I think they're so cute. And they get chunky. If you get chunky, chunky, they're so cute. But yeah, uh, I want like fifty thousand dogs, but I can't do all that. Um. Okay. Next, we have. Okay. Okay. If I won the lottery, this is what I would do: buy a house all like on the beach in Hawaii. Like, who wouldn't do that? That is. That is that would be so beautiful to just wake up and it's warm outside. There's no snakes in Hawaii, by the way. So you could just leave the door open and let the breeze come in from the ocean and just wake up and jump into the ocean, you know. But yeah. Definitely want a house off the beach in Hawaii. Next we have uh, just like another backpacking, hiking type of thing want to do that but with the strap on me because i watch way too many murder documentaries to not be strapped out in the wild so put that down there next we have a fashion designer when i was like whatever age that you're intellectually intact um i said i wanted to be a fashion designer and i would draw all the time and I used to sew all the time, but I stopped because college, but I'm getting back to it. Next, we have an uh, Apple computer because that'll come in handy when I'm, you know, to put my plaque, YouTube plaque next to it so I can edit my YouTube videos professionally. Um, yeah, put that right there. And I'm sorry if I'm rushing. I'm just trying to get it done because you know how iPhone storage is. Next, we have another traveling because, like I said, we catch flights, not feelings. And, like, there's so much in the world to see different cultures, different ways of living. Like, why would I want to stay in America forever? America is the ghetto with the Gucci belt. So next we have surfing. I want to learn how to surf, bro. You know, when I live in Hawaii, it'll be nice to know how to surf, you know. Okay. Plus, that just looks fun. Like, who, who found out how to surf? Ooh. Ooh. My hair got in my lip gloss. Okay, where am I going to put this? I'll put it right there. Next, we have a podcast. I eventually want to do a podcast segment. But when I get more followers or subscribers slash supporters, um, I want to do one with my brother and my cousins because they're just funny. Like, whenever we get together, we just be laughing so hard that we get, like, abs the next day and yeah next we have another self-care self-love you know 
getting massages, skin, uh, uh, you know, taking care of your skin and whatnot. <laughs> Next we have a great day. I want one so bad. They are so cute and giant. And the thing is, they're considered like lap dogs. They're good guard dogs, but they're not aggressive. But like, you know, living, being a um, single woman living on her own, it'll be good to have that protective thing. Like people see a great day and they're like, whoa, I don't want to mess with her. But really a great day. And it's like such a cuddle bug. Like they're so sweet. They're just amazing. I love Great Danes. I want one so bad. Like, if I won the lottery, first thing I would buy is a Jeep and two Great Danes because I just want one so bad. Like, I literally, when I got my job, uh, like, I calculated how much, you know, like rent, utilities, and if I could afford a Great Dane, which I can't <laughs> because, like, I don't want to feed my dog dry dog food. Like, I want to, you know, feed them a raw food diet and stuff and I can't afford that right now but in due time in due time so next we have another castle I was just googling pictures of castles and printed it off so yeah like think about how cool that would be to live in a castle there are these girls on tiktok that live in a castle and that's just I don't know that's just cool to me next we have a house off of the lake a lake house I guess you could call it because I don't know it would just be cool to like go in your front yard and then just go in a boat or something you know so there. I'm running out of space next we have a German Shepherd I want a German Shepherd too they're so beautiful and they're good guard dogs, and I have a thing for like long hair fluffy dogs, you know. So I'm gonna put that right here. Next, we have a koi fish pond. I think I talked about that earlier, but I love koi fish, they're so pretty. Um, my shower curtain is literally koi fish. I want a koi fish tattoo. And something about koi fish, they just make you feel inner peace. I don't know, like when you look at them, you just feel like everything's going to be okay and it just you just feel at peace. I don't know how to explain it. Plus, they look beautiful fish. Next, we have another hiking thing. Um, I think I have enough room for it. So, like I said, I, work, I like being outdoors. So, I feel like hiking is a fun activity, you know? And it's a good exercise. So... I'll put that right here. Someone text me. We have another mountain biking. Okay, honestly, I'm not going to put that up there because I'm running out of room. Okay, next we have traveling with friends. I have friends and traveling on there, but I don't have traveling with friends. So that's pretty self-explanatory. Um, yeah. I'm going to put that right here. Next, we have another cute little gaming setup. This is more my, this is more my type, you know. I don't know what this was. Okay, we're down to the last, like, six or seven. Next, we have artistic painting. I want to get better at painting. I don't know what it is about painting, Compared to drawing, but at painting, I'm kind of trash because my hand be like this while I'm painting, but drawing is much easier for some reason. So I'm going to put that right here. Next, we have a bearded dragon. They're so cute. I like them. Even though I'm terrified of reptiles, bearded dragons are pretty cool. And you can put little clothes on them. Um... I don't know. They're just like tiny dragons. They're cute. So definitely gonna get one of those, even though my mom said she won't come over. Next we have a motorcycle. I want to learn how to ride a motorcycle. 
because my mom she always wanted a motorcycle so i feel like i will carry on her wishes by riding motorcycles plus it just seems fun next we have okay i have like a thousand mountain biking ones i don't know why okay next skydiving i feel like everybody should skydive before they die because it's just like a out of body it looks like it's not an out of body experience it's just like a adrenaline rush thing and i just want to do it i have cousins who have done it and he was like you gotta do it so yeah i've always wanted to go skydiving next we have nature like beautiful scenery i just want to experience that in real life and not a windows desktop background um every morning at work when i log onto my computer there's like a new background and it's like a travel place and you can click like where it says the description of the picture and i'll actually like load a page and and um tells you like where it's at and what it is so i literally have a folder on my desktop of places that i want to travel to and yeah like there's so much more to life than working in nine to five okay we're down to the last two next i want this is another you know beach house house by the beach in hawaii because i hate living in the i don't even know what region this is we're literally in the middle of the map i live in kansas and the winters are brutal i hate the winter i hate driving in the winter i just want to be warm and happy all day last but not least we have another koi fish pond because they're my favorite fish and next to a parrotfish but yes koi fish pond brings you good luck and um i guess i'll squeeze it down in here and oh actually i think i have two more pictures in my planner i do okay let me i'm gonna just like rip it because i don't feel like getting my oh my scissors out the kitchen i just ripped this in hot okay actually i have two more we <laughs> i really want to have inner peace be more in touch with my spirituality be more spiritual i'm not really into religion because i feel like christianity was like a manipulation um used by slave owners to manipulate black people but i'm not going to get into that but um plus never mind i'm not going to get into the religion thing anyways i just want to be more in touch with my inner spirituality and get more into crystals i have my amethyst this has been my favorite necklace since 2013 so almost dang hold on hold on hold on hold on Twenty fourteen. Oh my god, I've had this for wow. Cause I got it in Florida with my marching band. Went to Florida to perform at Disney World. Now it's sophomore year. Twenty seventeen. So no, twenty fifteen. Okay, I've had this for seven years. But still time goes by so fast. That's crazy. Anyways, I have my amethyst. Um my aunt and I are going to go to this crystal festival, which is uh, on my birthday. Uh, that's crazy. And then I just found a crystal store here. And I just really want to get into like, I like Buddhism because it's more so morality based and like right from wrong. Like inner peace, like I said, her Buddhism, like, I don't know. I don't know. I only know the gist of it, not in depth of it, but I do want to learn more. So, yeah, spirituality. Um, I'll fit it down here. And then last, we have freelance. I really, like I said, want to work for myself. So, 
I like the idea of like freelance marketing, which my dad kind of had that idea like years ago, but we never followed through with it. But I feel like nowadays, a lot of people are starting their own business or have a business that's not getting enough attention and stuff like that. So I feel like being a freelance marketer, marketing person, is a good foot in the door if that makes sense probably not um let me make sure i'm not sitting on any more nope so this is my vision board i feel like to summarize i just want to live healthier happier travel more um Hey you all, so I feel like I missed a big part, but um, financial freedom is one for sure. I thought I kind of um, talked about that when I talked about being, you know, the rich auntie and stuff like that. So definitely I want to have financial freedom, which I feel like this whole board insinuates anyway, but yeah, I just wanted to touch on that. An abundance of wealth, reach my goals for YouTube. Uh, have a dog, a nice life. Notice how there's no man on here. Men, get it together. Ciao, anyway, so thank you for watching me making my manifestation vision board. Um, um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what to say. I'm so bad at YouTube. This is probably my longest video. Um, I don't know what I should say or do next because I'm awkward. But thank you for watching. And as I reach each goal, I'm going to fold it like this so that I know that I've reached that goal. So I feel like the first one that I will accomplish is probably becoming a dog mom. I didn't add another dog breed on here, but they're called Keithon. And I'll insert a picture of what they look like. They're very rare, they're very expensive. They're hard to get a hold of. Waiting list, long, okay? I got approved for one, but she never emailed me back and it's been like a month. So, uh, they're really hard to get approved for too, so yeah. And then probably the next one would be a friendship that I would fold because I kind of made a friend but not really like we're in the talking stage just get to know you stage of friendship and then we're supposed to hang out so we'll see how that goes but I'm not gonna hold my breath and then my next one would probably be Hmm, a tattoo because I really want a tattoo. But yeah, anyways, thank you for watching and I'll see you in my next video, which will be a four part series that I've been working on really hard. I've been getting so frustrated because it's just a lot of information and a lot of research. And then once you think you know something and once you think you got something, Oh wait, here's another concept, and then you have to research that, and then within that concept, there's another thing that you have to research, and it just keeps going on and 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 on. But I'll give you a hint. All I'm going to say is Ronan, the accuser. Him and what species he originates from. That's all I'm gonna say. Anyways, thank you for watching. See you in my next video.